This is the Great Salt Lake Desert. The Air Force owns a million acres of this remote, desolate land known as the Utah Test and Training Range. Over the last 15 years, Air Force archaeologists have found many artifacts just like these identical reproductions, but they've recently made a rare discovery. They noticed a small amount of black staining on the surface, and it was radiocarbon dated to 12,300 years old, which makes it the oldest open-air archaeological site in the entire Great Basin. It kind of blows your mind. In the unique circumstances that perhaps it's a, an animal roasting pit where they're using marsh resources. And from a lot of the early uh, indications, we don't have many other examples of this site type okay, in good. the United States. Among the discovered artifacts, many small waterfowl bones like this one. These perishable remains are extremely uncommon and we have them here in a pristine setting. Once the excavation is complete, the artifacts will be sent to a lab for additional study. From Joint Base San Antonio-Lackland, I'm James Truitt.